hello. Hi. Hello, teacher. Hi, good evening. Hello, teacher. Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Yes, can I hear you? Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Welcome to your English class number two. This is class number two for you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Very, very, very uh, responsible, very punctual. It's 8, it's 8 p.m. Wow, congratulations. I can see Ana Moreira, Claudia yes, Lopez, Andrea Geraldine, By Brian. So you guys are very, very responsible. Remember, you need to activate your camera. Your camera must be activated, okay? I'm here. So you have to activate your camera. There you go. There you go. Bueno, vamos a hacer la, quizás la asistencia un poquito más uh, como interactiva. Ok. Um, so, let me see. Sé que pues uh, siempre hay que hacer como un pequeño repaso, ¿verdad? De lo que hemos visto. Right. So, a manera de repaso, guys, mientras... Pues damos la bienvenida a los que se van conectando, pues los primeros 10 minutos lo haremos así. Ok, let me share, let me share. This is practically ways to introduce yourself, right? Ways to introduce yourself. Remember, you can say hi. You can say hello. 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 Hey. 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 And then you personalize, you personalize, you say only one, right? You say, hi, my name is Roberto, or you can say, hi, I'm Roberto, whichever way you prefer, okay? So you have to say that personalized and very natural, okay? Okay. Okay, so when you introduce, when you introduce other person, other friend, other classmate, other family member, you say, let me introduce you to my classmate, for example. Let me repeat. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me. Introduce, 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 introduce to my classmate. My classmate. You, my classmate. My classmate. Let me introduce you to my classmate. Let me, let me, let me introduce, let me introduce you, you to my classmate. Unamos ahí. Introduce you. Introduce you. Presentarte. Introduce you. Yeah. Introduce you to my let classmate. Let me introduce you to my classmate. Ahí damos el nombre, ¿verdad? Digamos que es, ok, Alex. Let me introduce you to my, class, to my classmate. Vamos a usar... Sí, que es para él, ¿verdad? Su nombre es. Para él. Es, y vamos a usar His Alex. Name. His name is Alex. Ok. His name is Alex. Alex. His name is Alex. Alex. Su nombre es Alex. Y si es ella, vamos a usar her. Repeat. Her. 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 For example, her, her. her name is Ana, right? Her name is Anna. Anna. So, hasta acá, esto es prácticamente lo que es, hemos visto, ¿verdad? De presentarnos, right? Y pues ahora vamos a estar perfeccionando lo que es uh, los possessive adjectives. Ese es el tema de ahora, chicos. Possessive adjectives. ¿Cuáles son los possessive adjectives? A ver, ¿alguien sabe cuáles son los possessive adjectives? My is ah. her. My is her. My is her. My is her. is her. I is her. Is her. Okay, okay. comencemos con my. My. Okay. My. A ver, one my. example. One example. 
One my example, phone. let me hear you. For example, my cell phone. My cell phone. My. Complete it, complete it. My cell phone. Le vamos a ayudar. My cell phone. Everyone, everybody. My cell phone is broken. Okay, my cell phone is broken. Perfect. That's a complete example, yeah? My possession, possession. My cell phone is broken. Let me hear other example. Give me another example. Let's go. My. Uh huh. My car is red. I'm sorry. Can you repeat? My car. My car is red. My car is red. Yeah. Okay. For example, my favorite food. My favorite is pizza. <laughs> what? Favorite food? Pasta. It's pupusa. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say pupusa. Okay. My favorite. My. It's possession. Possession. Um, for example, my is for the first person. My, okay. ¿Cuál es el otro uh, possessive adjective para usted? Your. 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 Can you give yeah. examples? Can you give examples? You said your. En este caso, nos tenemos que ubicar porque your, ¿para qué persona es? ¿Para la primera persona? ¿Para la segunda persona? ¿Para la tercera persona? Segunda persona. Sí. Para la segunda persona. Segunda persona. Entonces, bueno. Ok, si yo estoy aquí, ustedes están allá, tendrían que darme examples respecto a su servidor. Usted, ¿verdad? Usted, teacher. Eh, su, por, por, nosotros en español decimos tú, ¿verdad? Tu color favorito, tu apellido es, tu nombre es. Entonces, ¿cómo sería en este caso? Your, your favorite is color. Your, your shirt last name. Is, is white. Listen to that example. Excellent. Your shirt is white. Is white. Your shirt. Everybody, everybody. Your shirt. Your shirt. Your shirt. Your shirt. White. 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 Excellent. Give me other example. Give me other example. Your headphone is black. Podría ser en pregunta. Podría ser en pregunta. Ahorita estamos solamente afirmando si sí, podemos hacer en pregunta. Uh -huh. Is your shirt white? Is your shirt white? Excellent, excellent. That would be in question. That would be in question. Okay, your, your. Other example, your. Is your shirt Your name is Caleb. Your name is Caleb. Excellent. One like for you. One like. One, two, two. Like for you guys. Everyone, you're very intelligent. Okay, vamos entonces ahora sí a la attendance rapidito. All right, one second here. Let's start, okay? Remember, I'll say your name completely and let's do it fast. Let's start with Adan Isaias Cornejo Ramirez. Adan Wilfredo Arevalo Linares. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, sir. I'm here. Alan Enrique Rosales Sorto. Present, present. Thank you, sir. Um, Alexandra Milena Rendon Saldana. I'm here. Good for you. Good for you. And then Ana Gabriela Murillo Martinez. Ana Margarita Marquez de Castillo. Okay. Then we have, um, let me see. Ana Noemi Hernandez de Moreira. I'm here, teacher. All right, thank you. And then we have Andrea Elizabeth Gonzalez Burgos. Presente. Okay, perfect. Andrea Geraldine Sanchez Recinos. Present. 
Okay, thank you. Ángel René Esquivel and the Verde. Present teacher. Thank you. Ángela María Parada Castro. Present teacher. Awesome. Okay. And then we have Ángela María Parada Castro. Es quien acabo de decir, ¿verdad? Quiero ver. Present teacher. All right, all right, all right, all right. Just checking, just checking. Antonio Alberto Martinez Perez. Present teacher. All right, all right. Bernardo Antonio Herrera Diaz. Absent. Okay. Uh, Blanca Elizabeth Fuentes Menendez. Blanca Jamilet I am Aquino. Here. Okay, Blanca Elizabeth, estás? Yes? Sí, sí. All right, awesome. Okay, perfect. Okay, let's go with Blanca Jamilet Aquino Villa Mariona. Qué largo tu apellido, ¿cómo estás? Okay, one second. Vaya, vamos con Brenda Maricela Tobar Aguilar. Missing in action. Okay. Brian Isaac Escamilla Hernandez. Here I am. Awesome. There you are. And then Carlos Alejandro Perez Caravantes. Carlos Fernando Portillo Rivas. I am here. Okay, good for you, good for you. And then we have Carlos Manuel Ramos Cepeda. Present. All right, perfect. Carmen Guadalupe Camilla Orantes. Present. Okay, good. And then we have um, Carmen Lisette Santillana de Retana. Present, teacher. Very well. Next is Cesar Alejandro Ramos Cepeda. Present, teacher. Okay, there you go. Cindy Marielos Figueroa Mejia. I'm here, teacher. Uh -huh, there you go. So let's go with Claudia Lisette Lopez Alvarado. Present. Present. All right, awesome. Then Dalila del Carmen Romero Guerra. Present, teacher. Very well, watch your audio. Daniela Alejandra Candray Galvez. Present. Perfect. David Antonio Lopez Torres. Nope. David Benjamin Aguirre Ayala. Present. Benjamin? Okay, good. And David Ezequiel Sanchez Muñoz. Here I am. All right. All right. Very well. So, my name is Caleb Nunez. What's your name? My name is Mariela Figueroa. My name is Angela. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. It's nice to meet you. More or less, more or Amber. less, more or less. Uh, I'm sorry, what's your last name again? Moreira. It's Ramos. Correct, correct. Remember, short form, it's, it's no. Ramos. It's, 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 it's or or the long form. My last name is Ramos. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ahora ustedes yes, comienzan. Yes. Ahora ustedes comienzan. Introduction. Introduction. Three, two, one, go. Hello. Hi. My Hello. My name is. Hi. My name is Cesar Ramos. Hi. My name is Andrea. Hi, I'm Caleb Nunez. Nice to meet you. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry, what's your last name? Sorry, what's your last name? Again. 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 Okay. My last name is um, Nunes. In English, is Nunes. Yes, Nunes. All right, nice job, nice job. I like it, I like it. Any questions so far? No question, creo que estamos bien hasta ahí, ¿verdad? No We're question. Good. Se nos olvidó un poco la conversación, teacher. Se nos olvidó un poquito la conversación al final, ¿verdad? What's your last name again? Se... Uy, escucha confuso si yo les hago preguntas, por ejemplo, what's your, what's your first name? You, you distinguish that, right? What's your first name? What's your middle name, right? And what's your last name? Yeah? Yes? ¿Estamos bien ahí? Ok, ok, ok. Vaya, entonces vamos a hacer una dinámica antes de continuar, ok? Um, Yo voy a decir uh, la forma afirmativa y ustedes me hacen la pregunta, ¿ok? ¿Ok? Vamos a hacer un ejemplo. All right. It's, it's Elias. What is the question? Sorry? The first name. It's what's your name? What's your first name? What's your first name? Repeat, guys. What's your first name? First name. First name. Pronounce. Pronounce. What's your What's your first name? Your first name. Remember. Remember. The short form. It's Elias. The long form. My first name is Elias. All right? All right? All right. Next round, next round, next round. The answer is my middle name is Roberto. What is the question? What is your middle name? Correct. Remember, you can see what's your second or, or what's your middle name, right? Good job, good job. So my middle name is Roberto. That was an example, right? Okay, and the last example, the last example. Um, it's Ramirez. It's Ramirez. That's your what last your name. What is your last name? What's your last name? Everybody, what's, what's, your, what's your, last your, your, last name? your last name? My last name is Ramirez or it's Ramirez. Cuando hacemos una pregunta uh, de esta manera, guys, es súper formal eh, usar la palabra um, excuse me, right? Excuse me. Excuse me. Right? Excuse Excuse what? me. You say, excuse me, what's your first name? Excuse me, what's your uh, last name, for example? Okay, so we're going to share now the presentation. Uh, we're going to move on with our book. Okay, check the objective. Vamos a ver, let me see. Ana Moreira nos ayuda entonces con el objective. Puede leer, can you read the objective, please? By the yeah. end of this lecture. Uh, in English? Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> then, let's see. By the end of this lecture, participants will be able to buy your and her. In order to introduce their names, or to introduce a friend or classmate. Correct, correct. So we're going to learn to use my, your, his, para él, ¿verdad? His, yes. or her, para yes. ella. Okay, remember, distingamos eso, okay? Lo fácil es decir my and your, pero para él, his. Yes. Okay, y para ella, her. 
Ojo, oh, que ahí faltan más, ¿verdad? Ahí falta para esto, ahí falta para nosotros, ahí falta para ellos. Um, eh, les voy a estar mandando ahí siempre en el, en el WhatsApp, ahí videos para que vean lo, los vean completos. Entonces, esto es como una introducción a todos los um, possessive adjectives. So, here we go. Possessives. Let's check it out. Hi everyone. In this class, we're going to learn how to use possessive pronouns. My, your, his, and her. Let's get started. The first thing that we're going to do is listen to a quick conversation and then I'll illustrate how the grammar is used. What's your name? My name is Jennifer. What's his name? His name is Michael. What's her name? Her name is Nicole. What equals what is? Now, let's try to make sense of the possessives. We use the possessives whenever you want to express belonging. For example, my name is John. His name is Jason. Her name is Mary. Uh, as you can see on the screen, my name is Jennifer. His name is Michael. Her name is Nicole. Let me show you a quick guide to follow in order to understand this concept. I'll write the pronouns and the possessive. So let's see if I want to talk about the pronoun I and express some kind of possessive, I'm going to use my. For you, that will be your. For he, that will be his. His. And for she, that would be uh, her. Her. Uh, so, for example, uh, my name is Joe. Your name is Jason. His name is Michael. Her name is Nicole. Now, let's try to put it all together by illustrating some examples. My name is Joe. Your name is Mike. His name is Peter. Her name is Jane. Okay, okay, okay. You have any questions so far? Jane. You have any questions so far? So far, so no, good? Teacher. No questions? No, 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 I don't have. No you don't have any questions. Okay, practice time. Practice time. Let's practice our English. Okay. So we're going to give an example just the way it is on the board, all right, on the, on the screen. You see there, using my, using your. Remember, your, it's me because I will be the second person. He's for a man, male, and her for a lady, for a woman. Okay? So, for example, for example, um, hello, everyone, or hi, everybody, right? My name is Kalev. Okay, my name, my name is Kalev. Um, let me see on the list, I see Angela, okay. Her name, her name is Angela Parada, okay. And um, his, let me see, his name, let me see on the list, I see Carlos, so his name is Carlos Portillo, okay. So in the case of ustedes, van a usar todos, right? My name is uh, Carlos, for example. Your name is Teacher Kalev. Her name is para ella, right? His name is para él. Don't confuse. Don't confuse. For example, her name is Andrea, right? His name is Manuel. Her name is Claudia. His name is Alan, for example. Okay. Do you have any question? Are you ready for an example? Any volunteer? Do we have any volunteer? Uh, <coughs> yes. Eh, 
What is different? What is the difference entre? Perdón, se, o sea, te, se te cortó. Eh, no sé si me escuchan. Ahora sí, ahora sí. Este, ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre he y she? He y she. Ajá. Bueno, Oye. he es el sujeto, ¿verdad? He significa él. Ajá. Y, y she es ella. Hey. Ah, entonces, uh, veamos. Ah, ok. Ok, ok, ok. Quizás los podemos compartir de esa forma también, ¿verdad? Para que quede ahí clarito. All right. Sí. Ok, there you go. Sí, tenemos los subject pronouns, right? I y los possessive adjectives, my. Ok. Segunda persona, you. Right? Yes. Possessive adjective? Your. Oh. Your. Ok. Vamos con las terceras personas. He. Possessive adjective? Yes. 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 Ok. Yes. Ok. Yes. Vamos con she. Her. Her. Possessive adjective? Her. Her. Entonces, ahorita Her. hasta ahí, guys. Hay más información ahí que darles, ¿ok? Pero no quiero quizás uh, uh, adelantar. Ok, yeah. Ok, so quiero un ejemplo así, right? Tal cual, usando los, que vamos a usar? Los possessive adjectives. Possessive adjectives. Entonces, vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Let me... Do we have a volunteer? ¿Tenemos un voluntario? Volunteers? Hoy no. No volunteers. <laughs> By democracy. <laughs> Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Wait, ¿Quieren que haga otro ejemplo? Yes, please. Okay. Voy a suponer que uh, vamos a ver quién está ahí atento ahorita con cámara. Vamos. Okay. Vamos a suponer que Ana Moreira es. Right? La segunda persona, yo estoy hablando con ella, es una conversación con ella, entonces por eso con ella voy a usar your, pero uh, para darles uh, completo el ejemplo, ok? So, saludamos, right? Greet, you greet in English, you say hello, you say hello. hi, or you say hey, right? Hey. Hello, my name is Caleb, your name is Ana. His name is Brian Escamilla. And her name, her name is Alexandra Rendon. Do you understand? Yes. Perfect, perfect. Claudia, listen. Usted va a comenzar, Claudia, lista? Okay, let's go, Claudia. You can do it. Hey, my name is Claudia. Uh -huh. my name is Caleb. I'm sorry, repeat, I'm sorry. His name is Caleb. Your, your name is Caleb. <laughs> estamos. Oh, ahí estamos, ahí estamos, ahí estamos. Watch the audio, guys. Watch your microphone. Ok, estamos ahí. Yes. Yeah. 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 Ok, ok. Vamos a probar entonces con Andrea González. Let's go, Andrea. Give us your example. Uh, okay. Uh, hi, my name is Andrea Burgos. Uh, your name is Caleb. Uh, her, his name is Frank, and her name is Ana Moreira. Very well, very well. That's right. That's right. Simple as that. Good job. Good job, Miss Miss uh, Andrea. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, perfect. Volunteer. 
Volunteer. Antonio Martinez, are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Hello, my name is Antonio. Your name is Caleb. His name is Carlos. Okay. Her name is Andrea. And, and her name. Al final vamos a decir I. Su nombre es para finalizar. Ese I se dice N. A N D. A N D. Okay. Very good. Let's go with Carlos Portillo. It's your turn. Action. Good job, Antonio. Hi, my name is Carlos. Your name is Caleb. Her name is Dalila. Y her name is Cesar. Uh, are you sure? Are you sure? We're going to repeat. We're going to repeat. Remember. Yes. His uh, is for man. For man. Okay. Her, her is for woman. Repeat again. Repeat again. Hi, my name is Carlos. Your name is Caleb. His name is Cesar. And her name is Dalila. Bingo. Bingo. You see the difference? Her favorite color is pink. His favorite food is hamburger. So you're talking about, you know, characteristics of a person. All right, Ana Moreira, are you ready? Hola, Simis. Ready? Yes. Let's go. Yes, teacher. Um, hi, my name is Ana Moreira. And your his name is Caleb. I'm sorry? Your name is Caleb. Yes. Um, Shir's name is um, Claudia. Can you can you repeat? Can you repeat? And Shir's name is Claudia. Her her name is Claudia. Her name is Claudia. Repeat. Her name is Claudia. Her name is Claudia. Okay. Her name is Claudia. Mm -hmm. And and um, my son, his name. Ingmar. <laughs> his name is his Ingmar. name is his name is Ingmar. Oh Ingmar. Okay, very well, very well. Nice job. Nice job. ¿Quién más está listo ya? Hoy sí. ¿Quién oh. más? Yo. Who? Carlos. Carlos. ¿Cuál de todos? Carlos Ramos. Ramos. Let's go, Mr. Ramos. Manuel, let's go. Hi, my name is Carlos Ramos. Your name is Caleb. His name is Cesar. Her name is Cindy. And her name is Cindy. And, and her name is Cindy. Yes. Remember to sound natural. Okay. You have to play with the sound, right? Hello, okay. my name is Roberto. Your name is Francisco. Um, her name is Claudia. And his name is Kevin. So as, as much natural as possible. Incluso si estamos diciendo un nombre que es latino, guys, tenemos que tratar de pronunciarlo en inglés porque estamos hablando en inglés, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh, por ejemplo, si el nombre es Antonio, ¿verdad? En Anto Nosotros decimos en español Antonio, ¿verdad? Right, entonces estamos hablando en inglés, decimos, his name is... Antonio, no, tenemos que darle la pronunciación inglesa, right? His sí, name sí. is Antonio. Try sí, to pronounce a little. Dígame. Una pregunta, eh, que es mejor decirlo nativamente aunque el nombre sea latino o, o hablarlo así, por decirlo en inglés, o sea, tratar de ponerle como que el, el acento, a eso se refiere como nativamente, porque yo le puedo decir a... Ah, eh, my name is Ana, pero eh, pueda que allá se diga, ah, my name is Ana, o sea, ¿cómo sería lo correcto? Sería mejor en inglés, nativamente. Tratar de darle un poquito de pronunciación <ríe> inglesa, sí, oh, porque okay. estamos hablando en inglés, entonces, claro que hay nombres que no se pueden, ¿verdad?, eh, traducir, ¿verdad?, en, en inglés, pero eh, tenemos que tratar de pronunciarlo de esa manera, ¿verdad?, quizás... Eh, 
ponerle un no poquito me de... latino, latino, ¿verdad? No Correcto, no, no como español tal cual, sino ponerle un poquito de pronunciación inglesa. Right? Por ejemplo, José sería José. Antonio, Antonio. Right? Kevin, Kevin. Kevin. Okay? Roberto, Roberto. Ajá. Ajá. Roberto. ¿Y, ¿Y mi nombre cómo sería? ¿Quién, quién, quién me dijo? Ángela. Angela, Angela. Her name is Angela. Yeah. Así. Angela. No es Angela. También Angela. En otros estados pueden decirlo como Angela, right? Pero ya es más americano, mis, right? Por ejemplo, uh, Nicole, right? Nicole is an American name also. So, Angela or Angela. It depends, right? Acuérdense que hay tanta variedad ahora con los nombres también, ¿verdad? All right, ¿estamos bien? Are we all right? Creo que estamos bien ahí con los possessives. Quiero ver un ejemplo más. Eh, Alan, Rosales, you ready? Ready. Go, Let's go. go. Hi, my name is Alan Sorto. Uh, your name is Caleb. Yes. Um, his name is Carlos. And your name is Anna. That's correct. That's correct. Eh, Thank you. Tengo una pregunta. Yes, sir. Eh, ¿Por qué no se ocupa el chi? En esa el situación? chi. Uh -huh. Porque estamos hablando de una posesión. En este caso estamos hablando del nombre. ¿verdad? No uh -huh. estamos hablando de ella en sí. Ah, ok. Ok. Por ejemplo, estamos hablando de características de esta tercera persona. Right. Tú te imaginas que la foto de tu maestra y tú comienzas a hablar de sus características. ¿Qué posesiva adjetivo vas a usar? Si es ella. Her. Her. O, Her. Ojo a esa pronunciación. Her. En esa sí Her. se puede utilizar el she entonces. En ese caso se usa her porque estamos hablando de características Her. de ella. Por ejemplo, her name is teacher Juanita. Right? Yes, her nationality is Salvadorian. Yes, her her company's name is uh, Ministerio de Trabajo. Whatever. Her address, su dirección. Her address is um, Escalón neighborhood. Her telephone number. Yes. Her telephone number. Su número de teléfono. Her telephone number is. Entonces estoy hablando de cosas de ella. Si es de él. Yes. Yes. Se podría decir de que el she se utiliza más con la contracción to be, ¿verdad? Correcto. Digamos, eh, she is um, o she living in... Guatemala o algo así, ¿verdad? Es depende de lo que vamos a decir, ¿verdad? Si vamos a hablar de la persona, vamos a usar los subject pronouns. ¿Ok, Alan? Si vas a hablar de la persona, vas a usar los subject pronouns. Si vas a hablar de posesiones, de características de las personas, vamos a usar possessive adjectives. ¿Ok? Little by little, we're going to learn more about that. Let's move on. Vamos a compartir de nuevo. Hola, quería hacer una pregunta. Hola, dígame. Sí, quisiera que mmm, pronunciara un ejemplo con el her y con el she, por favor. Con el her y con el she. Por ejemplo, si vamos a hablar de una artista colombiana, a ver, ¿quién se sabe una artista colombiana? Shakira. Ok, Shakira. entonces. Oh, en serio también, ¿verdad? Entonces, ella es Shakira. How do you say ella es Shakira? She is Shakira. Shakira. She, digamos que tengo la foto acá, right? She is, she is Shakira. She. Ella es. Y ahí puedo contractar también. She's. 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 She's, she's, she's Shakira. She's Shakira. Ok. She's Shakira. Um, ahora, correcto. She's or she's. She's Shakira. Ok. Ahora, con, con el possessive adjective, her. Por ejemplo, su cabello. ¿Cómo lo tendrá ahorita? Wavy. Wavy, ok. Her, her hair. Su cabello. Hair. 
hair. Y no es que suene, y no es que suene algo repetido, ¿verdad? Sino que las, esas dos palabritas se aparecen en su pronunciación. Se las chateo acá. Hair, de posesivo. Y hair, de cabello. Her, hair. Her, hair. Is. Her, hair, is. Wavy, dijo la compañera, ¿verdad? Wavy, que es como... Wavy. 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 Que es como ondulado, ¿verdad? Como así... Quebradizo, decimos. Ok. So, hair. Hair es característica de ella. Por ejemplo, puedo decir, her telephone number is 555-212, bla, bla, bla. Right? Estoy hablando de poses de de ella. Ok, si hablamos de la persona, entonces sí, vamos a usar she. She's from Colombia, right? She's a singer, ella es una cantante, right? ¿Estamos? She is an artist. Yes, teacher. Awesome, let's move on, let's move on. Ok. Vamos a ver, vamos antes de continuar, quiero ver, tenemos todavía 10 minutos para avanzar. Ok, entonces, let me go next. Here we go. Que me gusta esto, ok, bye. Knowledge, knowledge check, guys. This is a knowledge check. It says instructions. Use, use. The possessives, my, your, his, or her, to complete the blanks. Okay, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Ahí están las instrucciones también en español. Leamos los ejemplos. Hello, what's your name? Hello, Hello. What's, your name? what's your name? Hi. Hi. Hi, my name is Antonio. Sería my, entonces ahí, ¿estamos my. de acuerdo? Sí. sí. Yes. Yes. Perfecto, ok, entonces ubiquémoslo ahí, por favor. Ustedes tienen acceso a esto, ¿verdad? Espero que lo vamos, lo vamos completando, ¿sí? ¿Todos lo van completando? No. No. Yes. No. no. What do you no, mean, no? No. no. <ríe> ¿Y qué pasó? Todos ya accesaron a su, plat a su platform. Nelson. De hecho, tendríamos que ir haciendo esto simultáneamente, ¿verdad? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah, What do you mean it. tomorrow? tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, y entonces, ¿cuánto, cuánto va conmigo ahorita haciéndolo simultáneamente? Nothing. Nobody. Nobody. No, no. Vale, entonces necesito, ¿Sí? guys, que comencemos. Porque recuerden, ¿cuáles son los requisitos para pasar el módulo? No completar los ejercicios eh, la plataforma está bien, presentar, presentar. está bien si se escribe primero en el cuaderno, lo resuelvo y de ahí pasarlo a la plataforma claro que sí, puede hacerlo eso. mejor, mejor, porque así practica <risa> doblemente, verdad y queda constancia ahí, entonces sería um, hello what's your what's name, your name? Y okay, la respuesta es Hi. 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 My name is Antonio. Very well. Number two. Number two. Read it. Read it. What's, What's her name? What's her name? What's her name? What's her name? Her name. Okay. Her name is Nicole. Her name is Nicole. Perfect. Her name is Nicole. It's for a woman. It's a lady. It's a girl. Okay. Number three. Let's go. Number three. What's his, his name? name? His, his name, name is Michael. Michael. His name Michael. is Michael. Michael. Very well. Let's check. Let's check answers. Let's Next. check answers. Let me see. Does it show answers? Answers. 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 Let's see the answers. Let's check the answers. Yes, my right. My name's Antonio. Number two, name her. Antonio. Her name her. is Nicole. Her. Right? Her. Hey, number three, 
His. His, his name, his name is, is Michael. 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 Very Michael. well. Very well. Yes. Este, para poder um, completar la plataforma, se le debe dar ahí en submit, ¿verdad? Como para que lo guarde de los logros. Miss, casi no le, casi no le pude porque se está como cortando. Can you para repeat? poder eh, rellenar la plataforma con las respuestas que creamos convenientes, tenemos, se va a activar ese botón de submit, ¿verdad? Correcto, de submit, oh. correcto. Oh. Mm -hmm. okay. That's right, that's right. What button? Hola. Submit. Acá, para que se envíe, okay. ¿verdad? Cuando ya la completan, le dan acá en submit. ¿Qué significa, pues, enviar, verdad? All right. All Entonces, right. possessive adjectives, possessive adjectives. One more practice, one more practice, one more practice. Vamos a ver quién no ha platicado este día. René Esquivel, what's up, René? Hello. Vaya, vamos a usar, vamos a usar los possessive adjectives. My, your, his, and her. Y quiero que usemos last names. Last day. Let's go, Rene. Okay. Uh, last name. Okay, okay. Her last name is Figueroa. What? Her, her. Sorry, sorry. Her last name is Figueroa. Okay. Uh, Ramos. Remember. Yes. Yeah. Yes. My last name is Fidel. Okay. Her last name is Escamilla. Is, and his last name is Ramos. Escamilla, ¿quién es Escamilla? Quiero ver quién es Escamilla. Carmen Escamilla. Carmen, ah, pues. Here I am. Estamos bien. Ah, es que hay dos, es que hay dos. Ah, se salvó, se salvó. Right, ahí está también Brian. Ok, ok. Let me see. Vamos entonces con. Let me see. Dalila. Can you hear me, Dalila? Hi. Ok, entonces usted va a usar middle names. Middle name. All right. Go ahead. My middle name is Romero. Your middle name is. Wait, wait, wait. Middle name. What's middle name? Second name. Second name. Remember? Second name. Go ahead. No, it's not last name. Don't get confused. Don't get confused, guys. Again, again. First name. Remember, first name. Everybody, first name. First name. Middle name. First name. Last name. Last name. First name. First name. First name. First name. First name. What? Yeah. First name. First name. First middle. Name. Middle. Middle, middle, middle name. name. Middle name. Middle name. Or, or name. second. Second name. Right? Second name. Second name. Last name. Last name. Last name. Last name. Last name. Last name. Memorize that. Memorize that by heart. Memorize that by heart. Right? Okay, natural. Let me see Daniela Candray. Are you ready? You're Hola. gonna use middle names. Middle names, Daniela. Give examples. My, your, his, and her. Let's go. <clears throat> My middle name is Alejandra. Her middle name is Alejandro. And repeat, repeat, he... repeat, repeat. His name is Alejandro. His, and... his middle name. 
His middle name is Alejandra and her middle name is Elizabeth. Elizabeth, ya estamos ahí como que luchando con destrabar aquí, destrabar acá, ¿verdad? Ey, pero ¿sabe cuál le faltó, Miss Daniela? Your. Con su servidor tenía que usar your. En este caso, yo sería la segunda persona, por lo tanto, tendrías que usar un ejemplo usando your. What's, what, what's your second name, teacher? Well, actually, my first name is Elias, and my second name is Caleb. I prefer Caleb. And so, your, no, your middle name is Caleb. Very well. One like for you, one like for you. Let's listen to Brian. Brian, that's Camilla. Vamos con last name. Sound natural. Hi, my last name is Escamilla. Your last name is Nunes. She's his last name Lorena. Yes. His last Her name. Last, yes. His his last name is Ramos. Her last name Morena. Very well, very well. Nice job. Nice job. Vamos a ver Andrea Geraldine. Do you want to try Andrea? Yes, yes. Vamos con first names. First oh. names. Uh, my first name is Andrea. Uh, your first name is Elias. Yes. yes. Uh, uh, her first name is Anna. Correct. And um, her name is Carlos. Can you repeat, Carlos? Can you repeat? Carlos. No, no. Ah, first name. Possessive, ¿cuál sería el possessive ahí con Carlos? His name is Carlos. Correcto. His first name, his first name is Carlos. And Geraldine, what's what's your last name, Geraldine? My last name is Sanchez. Sanchez, Sanchez. Okay, very well, very well. Vamos a ver, ¿quién no me ha participado? David, David Sanchez, no te veo, Alec. Sandra, Claudia, no los veo. Ahí estamos. Hi. All right. Hi, David. All right. Give us your example. Let's use first names. First names. Hi, teacher. My first name is David. What happened with the rest of possessives? My, my, my first name is David. Your first name is, is um, I don't remember. Elias. Yeah. Your name is um, Cindy and his name is Carlos. Very well. Vamos a ver, Ana Margarita Marquez, sister turn. Vamos con first name. Let's continue with first names. Hola. Yes, yes, yes. Sí. My name is Margarita. Mm -hmm. Your name is Cindy. His My name, name is Cindy? No, 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 no. And does it, your name is Carlos? Carlos? My name is not Carlos. <laughs> His name is Elias. What's Hola? my name? What's my name? Uh, your Caleb. name is Elias. Yeah. <laughs> um, His name is Carlos. Correct. Y her name is Claudia. Correcto. Si ve mis, si ve mis, my. Es para la primera persona, ¿verdad? My name sí. is Margarita. Sí. Con la segunda persona, your, your name, right? Face to face, your name is, right? Tercera persona, para él, his. His name sí. is Carlos. His name is Roberto. 
her, para ella. Her name is oh. Carmen Santiana. Let's go, Carmen Santiana. Lo voy a hacer con first name, let's say, ¿con qué? Ah, vaya, ok, <laughs> así de agresivo. Pues. Vaya, entonces, vámonos con second name. My second name is Lisette. Your second name is Caleb. Yes. His name is um, Blanca. What? Um, wait, wait, wait. Repeat, repeat. His name I, is I come. Is that correct, guys? Is that correct? No. No, his second. No. no. His Elizabeth. His second name. Second name. Second name. Second name. Ok, guys, 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 Carmencita, la voy a tener que parar porque miren, ya casi se nos va la hora y ya ni me había dado cuenta que ya casi nos vamos. Se salvó por la ahorita, ok, pero mañana continuamos. Voy a pasar teacher, lista teacher. por la última vez, dígame. Dígame, tell me, tell me, eh, ¿qué pasó? How do, you spell, how do you spell your name? My first name or my middle name? Uh, your first name. My first name is E L I A S. Okay. My pleasure, my pleasure. Vamos a, a anunciar solo a los que no habían um, ingresado al inicio. Ok, guys, ya los dejo ir tranquilos. Ok, let me see. Ana Gabriela Murillo Martinez. No. Ana Margarita Márquez de Castillo. Presente. Thank you. Then I have here Bernardo Antonio Herrera Díaz. Absent. Okay. In uh, Blanca Jamilet Aquino Villa Mariona. Okay. Brenda Maricela Tobar Aguilar. Absent. Carlos Alejandro Perez Caravantes. En serio. Ok. Y tenemos a David Antonio López Torres. Aquí. Yes. Yes, I'm here. Awesome, awesome. All right. Entonces, permítame, caballero. Aquí está. Aquí está. Bueno, es un poquito preocupante que estemos un poquito irregular, guys, con la asistencia. Es un módulo inicial. Esperaríamos que estemos todos acá, ¿verdad? Entonces, bueno, no me queda más que felicitarlos a ustedes. Congratulations. En la medida de lo posible, pues, trato de de hacerlos participar, guys, right? Eh, sabemos que es una hora y somos un grupo un poquito eh, eh, gordito, podemos decirlo de esa forma, ¿verdad? Entonces, um, hay que eh, valorar nuestra oportunidad de participar y pues eh, en caso que no nos toque, pues vamos a ir balanceando ahí con los días que van pasando. Ok, any questions? Do you have any questions? Do you have any comments so far? ¿Alguien tiene algún comentario? Sí, yo, Alan. Alan este, vamos. Entonces, con la plataforma tenemos que ir trabajando eh, ahorita con ustedes en la clase o después de la clase. Uh, pues la plataforma es totalmente tuya, Alan. Eh, tú tienes control de ella, ¿verdad? Teacher Caleb no va a estar ahí encima de ustedes, ¿verdad? No sientan tampoco la presión, pero <ríe> sí es importante que ustedes pues vayan avanzando. Recuerden que ustedes tienen que tener un contacto pues con el idioma y eh, lo que estamos haciendo en línea, yo lo comparto, ¿right? Pero ustedes lo tienen que tener también. Ustedes tienen que tener acceso a la plataforma, ingresar a ella y comenzar a avanzar porque Insafor, ¿right? Está verificando su asistencia y lo 
que usted está progresando, créanlo, ellos tienen acceso a sus cuentas, ellos pueden ver si ustedes han tocado su plataforma, eh, dónde van, si hicieron algún ejercicio, si vamos acorde con lo que estamos viendo en la clase. Entonces, les aconsejo que por favor lo hagan, que lo comencemos a hacer. Y si... Yo sé que la mayoría quizás está en teléfono, pero si los que pueden estar en computadora sería genial, ¿verdad? Que estén con su plataforma, right, y con la clase sería genial. Si no, pues con el teléfono, no worries, que ahí nos ayudamos todos. All right. All right. Already. Already. It's time to go. It's time to go. Good night, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow at 8 p.m. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. So long. Be safe. Take it easy. Be healthy. <laughs>